thought I would just pick up my camera today and vlog for the course of today as I do have a bunch of reading plans. I'm actually gonna go to a bookstore today. I know, crazy. Genuinely have not left my house in like three months other than to go to the grocery store like once. So this is quite the outing today. Before I head to the mall, I'm going to be finishing up my last 90 pages of A Court of Wings and Ruin, and then I will be picking up A Court of Frost and Starlight. A Court of Silver Flames, the newest book in the A Court of Thorns and Roses series, came out a few days ago, and I'm still finishing up the last bit of the series. So hence, I just wanted to really vlog my process of going through all of these books and share my thoughts and just the good times I'm having with this series. I think by the time you're watching this one, all of my thoughts for the A Court of Wings and Ruined book is already going to be done, so you can click that up here if you're interested, but today I will be attempting to read A Court of Frost and Starlight in the span of one day. It's roughly 230 pages, so I can't imagine it's going to be that crazy, but still something I want to aim for. Today I would also like to get some editing done, maybe get a new book at the mall today, I don't know, I'm just gonna take you guys along my day, have a good time, get a snack, and let's just have a good day together. I accidentally bought so many books, that's that's my bad. Hello everyone, as you can tell, I'm obviously back from the mall and I don't really wanna pick up what I got because then I have to wash my hands again and I don't really wanna do that. So I'm just gonna tell you guys what I picked up at the mall today, but you probably already saw, but let's talk about it. So I did not really go to the mall intending to buy anything. I just wanted to look around. However, since I have not really made any in-person impulse purchases in the last, you know, like 11 months, it just happened. So I did purchase three books from Indigo and I also got a new Nintendo Switch game. It's fine. It's okay. Who needs money anyways? But book number one is How the King of Elfheim Learned to Hate Stories. I really, really want to reread The Cruel Prince because I just... Every time I think about it, I just love it so, so much. And so once I reread that, I am going to really want to dive right into this book because I've heard just really fun things about it. So I am very excited. Next up is Rune and Rising, which I believe is the third book in the Grishaverse trilogy. I already own the first one and I figured, you know, while I'm out, I might as well get the rest of the series. They didn't have the second one, but I just wanted to get it while I was there because I am planning to read the trilogy in the month of March. And finally is a book that I've seen quite a bit actually for the last couple of years and it is called A Whole New World and it's essentially kind of a Disney retelling literally made by Disney itself I believe but there is a big main twist in the story so the story doesn't actually end or in the middle of it doesn't actually go how the original story is. So for this one it is featuring the story of Aladdin however we all know that Aladdin gets the magic lamp and makes the wishes whatever but the main plot line of the story is what if Aladdin never found the magic lamp and I think that is so cool. I love Aladdin a lot. I think it's a great story. And so hence, very, very excited to kind of dive into that like Disney-esque world again, which is something very new that I've never read. I've only watched movies of. So I think that's gonna be very, very cool. And finally is a very, very big impulse purchase, which is my Nintendo Switch game. It's a Bakugan Nintendo Switch game. It was on sale for $20 off. So it was only $50, which is a little bit more reasonable than the price it was originally listed at. So I got it. This is a really random fact about me, but I loved that series growing up and so when I saw this I was like damn like my childhood is in this game like I need to play it and so hence I'm very very excited for that. Additionally I read this book I have 30 pages left and I had to stop myself because literally in like the 50 pages I read I almost cried like three times and I was in like a public place so I was like we're gonna save the rest for when I get home which is now so once I'm done talking I'm going to go back to reading this book maybe take a little break from there and then maybe later tonight get started on a court of frost and starlight so that way i can start a court of silver flames very very soon but thank you all for joining me on my day so far i am now going to finish up a court of wings and ruins so i will probably talk a little bit more about that later but nice chatting with you guys Wow. 
So I just finished up this book, obviously. I'm just gonna be honest, it's five out of five stars. I loved it all. I'm kind of just like starstruck a little bit because I love it so much. I will be taking a little break tonight before I get into a court of frost and starlight, but like, this book was so good. I think by the time this video is out, yeah, definitely. I will have a video where I talk about my whole reading process of this book. So if you wanna check that out, click up here, but just like, just wow, this book was so good. I can't wait to read the next one. Oh, what a good day so far. <laughs> what a good day. Alrighty, hello. So I ate dinner, I walked a little bit of YouTube, played my new Nintendo Switch game a little bit, and now it is 8.30 and I've decided I'm going to start A Court of Frost and Starlight now. So I'm very, very excited for this. Honestly, even though I just finished the third book in the A Court of Thrones and Roses trilogy, I am ready to dive back into the world because I love it so much. And I know this book kind of has a very wintry, holiday-y vibe, and so even though it's February now, I really always like that time of year, so I am very, very excited to read more with all of these characters. And then tomorrow, maybe I can finally get to A Court of Silver Flames. So very, very excited. I have my cat, Levi, here to keep me company, and I'm just gonna get started reading this book. So without further ado. It is now 12 30 and i'm probably just gonna end off my vlog here but thank you all so much for coming along my day with me i got around 60 pages into a court of frost and starlight and i'm probably gonna keep reading for a little bit longer tonight but i really enjoyed talking with you guys and taking you along my day so i hope you kind of enjoyed this short and sweet vlog i love this series a lot i can't wait to continue reading it so definitely stay tuned for more videos where i'll talk more about this series very soon and I hope you all are having a very nice morning, afternoon, evening, whenever you're watching this. I'm probably going to get to bed very soon. But with that, I'm going to end off the vlog here. So I hope you all enjoyed and I will see you in the next one. Bye.